Hello and welcome to Feeding on Jesus International, where we believe that through the power of the gospel of Jesus Christ, we can feed and nourish the hungry. Don't be afraid to partake in the Lord's Supper, beloved. God has made it truly easy for his people to walk in divine health. We just need to come to his table, put our faith in his broken body for our healing and partake. It is so simple yet so powerful. That is why the devil has tried to steal this truth from the church by making Christians believe that they should not partake in the Lord's Supper. And he, he does this by making them believe that they are unworthy to come to the Lord's table. This erroneous thinking is largely due to a misinterpretation of the following verses. 1 Corinthians chapter 11 verses 20 to 30. For he who eats and drinks in an unworthy manner eats and drinks judgment to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. For this reason many are weak and sick among you, and many sleep. Now, beloved, what does it mean to partake unworthily? So let us read for ourselves what Paul said so that we can partake in a worthy manner. 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verses 27 to 29. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat and wherefore whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of the bread and drink of that cup. For he that eateth and drinketh and readily eateth and drinketh damnation for himself to himself, not discerning the Lord's body. Firstly, in verse 29, the word says that if you eat and drink unworthily, you bring damnation to yourself. Let us get one thing straight. The word unworthily is an adverb, which means it modifies the verb. In this case, unworthily describes the action of eating and drinking. It does not describe the person who is eating or drinking. So Paul, was, so Paul was not saying that if you are a worthy person, do not partake. Yet the church has somehow misconstrued that teaching and now Christians are saying, if you are unworthy, don't partake. They say if you have sin in your life, don't come to the Lord's table, lest you become weak and sick and die prematurely. They have turned something that is meant to be a blessing into a curse. In any case, allow. In any case, all of us who come to the Lord's table are unworthy and made unworthy. In any case, all of us who come to the Lord's table are unworthy and made worthy only by His blood. It is only Jesus' death that qualifies us to partake. Paul was not saying that we should not partake if we are unworthy. He was saying that we should not partake in an unworthy manner. What does it mean to partake unworthily? Stay tuned. Remember, share this video and bless your soul. Shalom.